If GRT were alive today, she will most likely tell you, Griselda, thank you for staying loyal to the family and to Rustans. Thank you for bringing out the best from yourself to help define what a lady Rustan should be. Between my mother and Griselda, there was a very special relationship. Mrs. Tantoko was like a second mother and a friend to me. She would ask me about my personal life, give me advice, and, you know, learn more about me. I remember when I was in New York once, she asked Marilyn to call me to join her in Olympic Towers. When I was there, she called me inside the room and she gave me $300. I said, what is this for? Oh, this is my gift to you. You can add to your, to your pocket money. I said, oh my God, you're an angel, you know? Because really my money that time was already dwindling. And so that was one of the things that I cannot really forget. She was really so nice to me. I really appreciate that. I think Griselda has always been inspired by my mother. Both of them had exactly the same taste in fashion. I think that lives on with Griselda to this day. The one that I perceive to be the most important is to have a vision. The best formula I learned from GRT is to put in priority the needs of my clients. She was my inspiration all my life, even up to today. The desire to achieve what I feel is her vision for Rustan lives on, I think, I hope, to all of us. I would say GRT was inspiring. I would like to thank the Tantoho family, especially Ambassador Tantoho who came all the way from New York to join us tonight, and Mrs. Glessy Tantoho, my mentor and my inspiration. <laughs>